This is Life with Timmy D. I have a slightly longer video on this, but this is going to be a short, hopefully two minute video. I'm going to show you how to add your GPS telemetry to a time warp video. Adding it to the regular videos is very easy, but some people have had problems with a time warp. So here we go. We're going to first bring in, and let me get me off the screen. We're going to bring in the video to telemetry overlay, which is the software that I'm using. It'll take about 30 to 45 seconds. As soon as it's in, I'll be right back. Okay, so after you bring your video in, you'll be looking at this uh, blank screen if you have your settings like me with no gauges being added automatically. First thing you're going to do is go to Add Gauge. Come down, we're going to add GPS path. It'll throw it up in the middle of the screen. I'm going to move it over. And again, we're using telemetry overlay as the software package. Um, I will go into Shape, set my map to the hybrid so you can see the background. I'll make it a square. Again, this is the first three minutes. We want to see the entire route. So I'm going to sync telemetry. I'll say I want it to match the video link. And for a full explanation of all this, see my other more in-depth video on it. Now I want to change the gauge and the path. I'm going to shrink those down just so we can get the sync on it set down to a little more precise so i'm going to blow this up move it over now i'm going to move down to this corner so i'm going to fast forward the video here whoa that's too too far right right there okay and i'm going to come on around the corner now that corner right up here that's where i'm going to that's what i'm going to use to match it up to the map you can see the red dot has already gone well beyond that so i'm at the intersection at the corner and I'm right here so what I want to do is take the offset move it back one second was all that was necessary so now I'm going to shrink it back down move it back up in the corner let's take my red dot make it a little bigger bam now go back play it and you'll see that the dot is now moving in real time with the time warp and exactly matched up with where it needs to be. All right, I hope it's been helpful. Hit subscribe, like the video, and again, if you want a little more in-depth onto uh, what I've done with this and why we're doing some of the changes and even adding some other telemetry, look at my other longer video. Hope it's been helpful. Have a good one.